Hey, what's happening? I'm Allie. Have you ever seen this show up when you open up a project in Premiere Pro? Media offline? What the heck is that? Well, don't worry, there's an easy solution to relinking your media that I'm gonna show you in like 17 seconds. First, why does this happen? There are several reasons that your media could go offline. Like if you have files imported into your Premiere Pro project and outside of your project where the original source file lives, you move the location of it around or you rename it or you delete the original file. Well, if you do any of those things, Premiere can't link back to the original source file. So you've got to relink it yourself. Let's look at how to do that. So we're in Premiere and we've got some clips that are offline scattered throughout our project. Let's make these offline clips a little easier to spot by right clicking on the top of our project panel and choosing metadata display. In the search bar type in status and under Premiere Pro project metadata check mark status. Okay. Now we can click on the status bar to organize all of the offline media so we can easily select it all. Right click on that selected media and choose link media. And you can see the file path where the original files lived. The top file's already selected, so now let's click locate. And since all of the offline files were in the same folder on my hard drive, when I click OK, all of these files will also relink. So that's pretty easy, but let's say we went over to our folder that the video files are in and moved one of these files out of the folder. I'm just gonna move this clip onto my desktop. Now, when we go back to Premiere, this pop-up window shows that the file is offline again. So let's click locate and the clip's still not showing up. If this happens and you know that file is somewhere on your computer or your connected hard drive, click search. And now Premiere is searching my entire computer for that file, which is gonna take a little bit longer because it is going through so many files on my computer. And there we go, the file's been located. Click OK. So while that's how to relink offline media, in a few different situations, keep in mind that relinking footage that's located in a random location isn't a very professional workflow. To stay organized, you'd want to have any project assets existing in one folder and then relink them to that location rather than having them located in multiple locations. As a Premiere Pro editor, what do you get stuck on or wish you knew how to do to make your edits look better and stand out and be more creative? Let me know in the comments below what you wanna know because there's a pretty good chance I'm gonna create a video about it. Thanks for checking this one out. If you wanna be a better filmmaker or video editor, subscribe to our channel. We release weekly videos about how to do both of those things. We'll see you in another video.